Oh, look at Hello, that. this is the beaver house. I fucked you. Ha. I win. Well. <laughs> welcome to the final episode of Josie's appearance on the beaver house, everybody. Hooray, I'm going to die. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> After all these years, I get to die. God damn it, Josie, no. Anyway, so we were talking about Snoopavision and why it could s and how it could save the world. Apparently. Yeah. So like people are going to make reaction videos and we, there's nothing we can do. It's just going to happen. So like what if what if what if instead of of just making a video that's basically a vlog but has another video in the corner all the time all the time. Oh, that's why I got it mic I got the Nest of Evil and Portrait of Ruin mixed up and started calling it the Den of Evil. They're called Dens of Evil in this game. Yeah, and this game has boobs, so it's easier to focus on. God damn it, Josie. You know I don't swing that way. Yeah. And furthermore, you don't it's need not to be you focus on it anymore, is it? Because you keep missing everything that's going on when you're talking about other shit. What was I talking about? Snoopavision? Yeah. Why? I don't fucking know. You tell me. Oh, yeah, because it could save the world. How? We, we, well, what if in, anybody can just make a Snoopavision? No. Then, in, then instead of reaction videos, we can have virtual reality reaction videos. Yeah. <laughs> that, no. That's not going to do anything to the world. It's gonna save you two. No, it's it's really not. No, you watch. It's gonna save the world. Snoop Dogg is like, not going to save YouTube. It's gonna be like Thanos is gonna be destroying shit, and then Snoop Dogg is gonna show up and say, "Hey, stop that." And then Thanos is gonna be like, "Oh shit, I guess I gotta stop." And that's gonna be the blood of Infinity Wars Part Two. No. Just, just no. Gonna, Straight up, no. Only gonna be like three minutes. Watch, watch. Part one's gonna end with Thanos ripping Captain America's shield in half. Then part two is gonna start. Snoop Dogg is showing up and saying, "Hey, stop that!" And Thanos is gonna be like, "Okay." Then you're gonna glue the shield back together, give it back to Chris Evans, and be like, "I'm sorry. Let's go play video games." Okay. And like, and then like, Captain America is gonna be like, "What's video games?" I'm from the '60s. I'm sure by now he knows what video games are. Hey, he had a list in, in in Winter Soldier of stuff that people tell him he should look up. And on that list were things like Star Trek that he should know about by now. If he's coming from the 60s, he should already know about Star Trek. Just different to your Star Trek. Yeah. You know, OG Star Trek. Exactly. It's like... Oh. Isn't, wait, isn't Captain America from the 40s? Oh, crap. I gotta look this up. Um, it was World War II, Josie. The, the timeline... The, ti the Marvel's timeline changes. Um, it was still on. World War II. Hold on, I gotta pay attention to this new character. Okay. Why do all the women have... There's all literally women nothing have interesting about these characters, Josie. You picked the worst opportunity to start paying attention. I know! Ham! Yeah. Ham! And Dan. now absorb Dan. the ham's I don't... You got Dan. the ham stick! Do you... Dan, do you want ham? I don't I got have the any ham, stink. ham. I got the ham stink. And they'll and it'll feed me ham! Evil ham. Tom, you can't fool me with ham. I've seen the bodies. Uh, I was referencing Sonic Boom. What were you referencing? Tom Scott. Okay. 
He made a video I where he could... watched mo I, I've only watched like three episodes of Sonic Boom, and there's apparently a second season now. He made an episode where he killed his roommate. Seriously though, Sonic Boom, it's good, right? Yeah. Why'd they put so much effort into the TV show of this video game? Because it was made by different people, and they were probably going to market it. They, they thought it was going to do better, but I guess the show was the only part that did good. And really it did, because like the characterization of Amy in that show is much better than her characterization in the main series. Yeah. And by like, that, I mean no characterization other than being Sonic Stalker. Kind of like Tails, too. Hmm. I love Eggman. Yeah, well, love, Eggman just, is always good. That's not saying much. I mean, Mike Eggman. Pollock... Do, do the fact that Mike Pollock is the only remaining four kids actor that's been licensed after the other actors were uh, brought out of the series says quite a bit. Yeah. But yeah, so Eggman's characterization is always good. And and I like the redesign for Eggman. He's bas he basically he's basically just the pre just the previous design of Eggman, but he, he, he like lifted weights. And he got buff. Yeah. He's even less shaped like an egg now. He's got a th Okay, yeah, I don't like that part. I think Eggman should be shaped like an egg. Like at least he's still bald. So the word, the term Egghead still applies. Very true. There's a Marvel character called Egghead. Really? I think he's voiced by Wayne Knight in the Superhero Squad show. Wayne Knight is great. Yeah, I want Wayne Knight to play Punisher Sidekick in 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 the MCU again. He already he already played the microchip in uh, one of the mo in one of the live action movies, but fuck it, do it again. Yeah. I, 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 th okay, so, I don't want, I think Nicolas Cage, like, okay, I haven't really, I, I, I think I saw Ghost Rider, I wasn't really into Nicolas Cage's Ghost Rider, but like, I, th I want, okay, so Nicolas Cage's original name was Nicolas Coppola. He's yeah, actually, I, I think we've discussed this before. Yeah. He's related to the director, he changed his name to Nick Cage, because his favorite character was Luke Cage. From comic books. Yeah, as I said, I'm pretty sure we've discussed this at least once before. Well, I liked saying it. Yeah. Uh, Luke Cage's name, Power Man, is actually re is actually reused from a white guy named Power Man, who actually fought Luke Cage over the name. So I think that I think that guy, Nicholas Cage, should play that guy. Yeah. I think his name is. I think his supervillain name is Goliath. Um, okay. He's actually a member of the Thunderbolt, so he's actually currently a so so he's actually a superhero now named named Atlas. All right. So he's pretty. He's pretty cool. So spoilers. In order to get the good ending of this game, you have to get all of these uh, Tinker Bats. Because you have to collect all the dark magic in order to get the true final boss. So, so, so the spinning dog. Her name is Tink, short for Tinkerbell, and you said she's Batman. So I guess she'd be Tinkerbat. Yeah. They're swimming in drool. More boots. Okay, swimsuits. Yeah. Oh, I feel inadequate. <laughs> what? That's so much hotter than I am. Yeah. Ah, hieroglyphics. Activated by boobs. Almost literally. Boob-powered hieroglyphs. That gave me a petrification spell. Well... I... Something would petrify, I guess. I don't know. Erection joke? Uh, you, well, I knew you were trying to make that joke. It was just the articulation of it only sort of made it apparent. <laughs> God damn it, Josie. This series sucks. Huh? We need to. We need to. We need to do the whole thing over. What? Why? Because I don't. I was asleep. No, 
you weren't. <laughs> <laughs> Who's to say? Maybe you were asleep the entire time. Well, that would be very impressive since I'm playing the freaking game. Maybe you're dreaming. Okay. Huh? Maybe you're dreaming. You ever think of that? What if no, you're dreaming? Actually. Well, fuck you, I'm gonna eat a cupcake on air. Fuck's sake. You need to stop, Josie. I need to stop eating cupcakes! I'm eating too many cupcakes! Eat crunchy Cheetos instead. I don't have crunchy Cheetos! I have Cheez-Its and cheese nips. You know what would also help is if you started buying, like, fat-free cupcakes and shit like that. Because they do you make know, that shit. You know what would be- you know what would be better, though, is if I could just stop buying cupcakes. But every time, every time I go to Walmart, I think, Oh, well, God! See, if, you, if you buy fat-free shit, it doesn't fucking matter. What if I buy- what if I just don't buy the cupcakes? What if I just don't buy cupcakes? But we all know you can't do that. I, we all know I can't, but what if I can? But you can't. We know you can't. You know you what can't. If I know I can't, but what if I believe in the heart of the cards? I can then see. Then you'll fail even more. I know, what if I believe in something that matters? Like Shuma. <laughs> Heart squid. Yeah. Wait till you see what happens to them. Oh my. I sounded like a I, I sounded like a clickbait article there. Wait until you see where Sh where Shante sticks the heart squids. Oh god damn it! That's not what I meant. So yeah, um, in case you haven't noticed, Shante is a Metroidvania, and I didn't know that until we until I actually started playing the series myself. What did you think it was? I thought it was just a platformer. Why can't it be both? Yeah. There's another heart. There's another heart squid, Liam. And I failed miserably to get it. There's another heart squid, Liam. Yeah, there is, and I got it that time. Okay, now now fail miserably to get back up. No. No, no, you gotta. I don't want to. For the viewers. Fuck you. No, don't fuck me. Fuck the viewers. Oh, okay. Turn no, just that man is apparently really hot. I've decided to call the viewers Poopy Buttholes. Because you, I showed you Toronto Batman. Yeah, he's hot. You, it has come to my attention that none of you viewers are buying his shirt. Or bu have bought shirts. Liam's the only guy who buys shirts. Come on, guys. Do you want us to be like Evil Craig? Come on. Yeah, I've bought two shirts from the store, and the one that I bought, the, the first one I bought was like last, like two years ago that I bought it. Yeah. I wore like, Con Bravo. So everybody, you need to buy shirts or else Liam won't have any more pancakes. That reminds me, Doug is going to whore us out at Anime North, so be prepared for that. There, are, according to him, there are a lot of uh, local YouTubers there that are, that are going to be there, and he's going to try and get them to promote us. So that should be neat. Okay, got okay, viewers. I'm, I'm post a comment on this web zone if you want a pizza roll and send Liam. Pancakes in the mail. But why? Because, Liam, I want to see if I can get the viewers to send you pancakes in the mail. But they don't even know my address. Uh, okay. Um, five, 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 but, 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 but. That's not accurate. <laughs> <sighs> That's a game government reference. <laughs> okay. That's all our show is. It's a Game Grumps reference. We're not yep, even. We need real. to stop that. We're not even real. Uh, we're just CGI. And by the way, the viewers are called housemates. You gotta stop forgetting that. Poopy buttmates. Holy fuck! You're bad at this. Shut up. Maybe I should call you the poopy butthole. Shut up. Anyway, no, I don't actually hate the viewers. They just need to buy more shirts. I love the viewers. Yeah. But they need to buy more shirts. Anyway, uh, Mr. Poopy Butthole is a Rick and Morty character. Okay. He just showed up one day, and everyone loved him. Okay, then. Also, there were happened to be aliens who would impersonate loved ones. That would just show up one day, and then you'd love them. Okay. Spoilers, Mr. Poopy Butthole was one of them. Well, wasn't. 
I still Whatever. need to watch Rick and Morty sometime. Yeah, you do. You already said that you're not going to watch Rick and Morty until you move. Yeah, we're going to have a marathon of it when I move. Yeah. Beaver House 1.2. Um, I made myself sad because I remembered Venture Brothers season finale was disappointing. Really? Like, it was good, but as, but like... Damn it, I won confirmation that Von Ark's dad was Vandata. Uh, well, that's obviously never going to happen. It's, it's special, it's obvious. Yeah, but still. <laughs> oh, fuck! Yeah, you deserve that for, Shut ruining, up. for ruining my dreams. I will continue to ruin your dreams at every possible opportunity because so, like, you. There's a so like, there's a rumor that um, the Adventure Brothers are just not gonna, they're just gonna retcon Vendetta to not be Monarch's dad because everyone already figured it out. Okay. And like, I don't like that because what, what's the point of having a, of having of having a show with lore that you want people to figure out if you're gonna retcon stuff when people figure it out? That's yeah. stupid. No, you're gonna make. You're gonna make the monarch's dad Vendetta. You're gonna make the monarch's dad the Green Hornet. You're gonna make Robocop and Green Hornet the same character for some reason. You're gonna like it. You're gonna. You gotta. You gotta kidnap the the creators of the Venture Brothers and hold them hostage. Come on, Josie. What the fuck are you spouting? You're gonna kidnap the Venture Brothers. Why though? You're gonna. You're gonna do it. Okay. You're gonna do it, Liam. But why? Because Liam, a hundred years, Rick and Morty. God damn it, Josie. Do you even know what that what that means? No. Good. <laughs> <laughs> you? Yeah, I do. Because I watch Rick and Morty, unlike you. Fucker. So I get all the memes. And you don't know the memes. I was born in the memes, molded by them. My ba my Bane impression just gets worse and worse. Every time. It's not horrible. It's just funny. But Bane isn't supposed to be funny, so you fail. I, I was molded by the memes. Now that's just bad. I was molded by the memes. Holy fuck! What are, these, what are these things? Yes, they are. That's good. Not anyway. the fight, that's what they are. Anyway, I gotta eat this cupcake. I'm gonna use a pike ball. I gotta eat this cupcake. There is a Star Trek captain named Pike. He, he was the he's the one with he's the one with the weird wheelchair. Yeah, one of them. One of the weird wheelchairs? There we are. No! So oh, in Patch. Oh, Terry died quickly. Uh, Professor X was also modeled after after Patrick Stewart. So. I knew that. When, when, when uh, Patrick Stewart was, was first shown an X Men comic, he was all like, What am I doing on the cover of a comic book? <laughs> Did I already talk about the about Samuel L. Jackson on our recording? Yeah, I believe so. Yes. Right. It's basically like half of the voice actors that play Marvel characters were all like had, had basically gotten the job by contacting Marvel and saying, "Hey, hey, look, it's the first boss of Met. It's one of the bosses from Metroid Zero Mission." It is. Sort of. I'm trying to figure out what boss you're talking about. The plant boss. Okay, this this isn't at all like a plant boss. There it is. Look at it! It's a Venus flytrap with a eye in the center. Have you played Metroid Zero Mission? Yeah. It doesn't have an eye in the center, but it's a thing still. Okay, you might be thinking of the worm boss. No, there was a plant boss in Zero Mission. Yeah, there was a plant boss that hung in the middle of the ceiling and was kind of round, but it wasn't an eye that shot lasers. 
Well, this is an eye that shoots lasers. Oh, okay, it's perfect. It's perfect logic. Um, it's it's obvious. It's obviously the same because it's not. Yeah. It's like the bo the boss in Metroid Zero Mission wasn't an eye that shot lasers, but this one is. Therefore, it is. Yeah. It's, it's perfect. It's flawless. Uh, you can't uh, argue with it. Seriously, Liam, that was way. That thing is like way more similar to the charge beam worm than. Why is she spinning in the air? Tinker bats. So why that guy have about have a head? Yeah. <laughs> why does that guy have a head? That's what I just. That's asked. normal. That tends to be normal, Dozy. Oh, yeah. That that's tends to be normal for guys to have a head. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, Liam, uh, do you have a head? Maybe. Oh. I'll never tell. All right. I'm going to eat this cupcake. Yeah. Oh. I mean, you stop, right? That's a mermaid. You really need to stop, Josie. That was a mermaid. Yeah, it was. You're just noticing that now, are you? I don't know what that was. Yeah. Oh, this is like a frog or something. And these little red things like crabs. Yeah, yeah. little like little crabs. Yeah, they are. Crab? Crab people. Crab people. Crab people? Yeah. So is Risky Boots not a villain after she kidnaps you? Oh, and the, what she works with her in this game for a common goal. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because that's the, that's the sense that's the sensible thing to do after someone kidnaps you in a bathtub that you don't own. Yeah, we'll see. Everyone's in danger now. Yeah, but only Shantae was naked. Okay. Well, in the next episode, we'll be heading to Spiderweb Island, so because we'll see nobody you then, else, Nobody else was naked except Shantae, ever. Sound logic. <laughs>